Well, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whatever time it is that you're watching this. Today we've got a deck over from the Discord of Jank Plays TCG. And this was shared to me by Murtaugh. And it's a electric or yeah, the electro deck, Bang Boom Chain, which is the main attacker, for, at least for the start of the game, where it says before doing damage you may discard any number of tools from your pokemon this attack does 40 more damage for each card you've discarded this way and it's a one energy attack so you can get it up and running really quick using um this voltorb here really didn't have any uh you know what let's see what other voltorbs there are just to see if there's any other better option perhaps but i don't think there's really much in the way that we have of voltorb so no um, but the key bench sitter in this case is Honchcrow here. With its boss pocket, you can hold up to four item cards per Honchcrow, which is really going to help get your Electrode to have enough <clears throat> tools out there to really do a big attack. And when all's said and done, you come up with this Rotom here, and you scrap short, which is 40, plus 40 more for every um, trainer tool. Yeah, for every tool in your discard pile that you select and move into the lost zone. The instant charge is also great for the first round or two. If you're not able to get off an attack, you just draw a few extra cards. I'm going to jump over to energy because there's just seven energy here. Seven electric. Really nice and simple. Um, there's still a lot of finesse work to be done in this deck, I believe. But... What we've got going on so far are a bunch of different tool cars, wind up arm, experience share, box of disaster, vengeful punches, um, and bravery charms. I think those are all the tools. Oh, uh, and then two four seal stones, which are important you can put on your honch crow or your rotom to use to draw any card that you want. So they work out really nice. Um, we have a bunch of toolboxes to draw tools out of your deck as you're going. I threw in three Iono. Um, usually you can play down your hand to almost nothing, so you have that one Iono at the end and you just draw some new cards, which is nice. Uh, we have four Level Ball and four Nest Ball as our retrieval, because all of our Pokemon can be pulled out by Nest Ball or Electro can be pulled out by the Level Ball. We also have the Town Store. Just go into your deck, pull out a tool card. Great stadium for this. For this, uh, my other two supporters are Arvin, pull out an item and a tool, and then Cynthia's ambition, which is good for when your electro goes down. You can uh, was it draw until you have eight cards in your hand, which is really nice. So that's what we have so far. I've only done one match with this just to kind of test it out, but we're gonna take it all out onto the casual ladder and see what we can find. All right, and we have a match with, I'm not even gonna try and say that, I'm terrible with names to begin with. But let's see what kind of deck they've brought. We have our Electro Go Boom deck. Oh, I like the shimmer in that Pikachu coin. I might have to go and purchase one if it's available. All right, they got the heads. They're probably gonna to wanna to go first. That's what most decks in the format right now wanna do anyway. Yeah, look at that. Who would have thunk? Who would have guessed? Alright. Not the best Pokemon to start with. Luckily, nothing has more than a one retreat cost in this deck. So, two Magnemite. So, which Magnezone are we running here? My guess is this is going to be Magnezone EX, which isn't going to be too bad for us because we don't really play more than like one or two energy on the field anyway. Huh. All right. Uh, we definitely want Voltor about. Could do that. Do that. And then we'll load this guy up. Yeah, we'll use Toolbox, see what we can get out of it. Just one EXP share, nothing too crazy. We will use Star Alchemy. 
What do I want to get with Star Alchemy? I could get Arvin. Hmm. Do I want to? I don't know. It'll give them an extra card, but it's not a big deal. I'm gonna read this again. You know what? We'll we'll do Cynthia's. Get me some three cards. Hey, hey. see that's what I want. We'll just draw here with instant charge and see what happens. All right, we got energy. We got another Hunch Crow, Toolbox, Arvin. I think one thing that this deck is missing is maybe a, a switch or two. Oh, uh, bye, Iono. Thanks, Iono. I had Electrode and had Energy in hand. Hmm. I placed on the Honch Crow and the Voltorb. Maybe grab another Honch Crow with that. Badoof. But yeah, like I said, it's hard because I don't have any switching options except for a hard retreat. Ooh. All right, we'll pull out Honch Crow here. I'll play that. That. What do we got? Oh, just one box of disaster. Okay. And we shall. I don't know. I know it gives them a bigger hand, but I gotta, I gotta play the game. So. So we have our level ball. Don't want to play this yet. No, we'll hold on to it and just do another instant charge. Alright, so next turn, if Honchkrow is still in the active, I can attach an energy, retreat it, and just start attacking, which will be nice. I have my stadium to be able to draw another tool card. Looks like they're get, they're getting a slow start. We are too, so it's working out at least in that in that aspect. Uh, and they got their draw combo. I guess all they need left is a Pidgeotto to really get going what they want. And their deck heavily relies on. Most likely, yeah, rare candy for both the Magnemite and the Pidgey. Which I think the new Pidgey is good because it has, if I remember correctly, the, the Call for Family attack. Colrus, what are they doing? What are they getting right up? Alright, Pidgey and an Ultra Ball. Oh, yeah. Here comes our Pidgeot, which is probably going to pull out to get them a Magnemite, or a Magnezone, is going to be my guess. Mm -hmm. Oh, they are digging. All right, here it comes their Magnezone. Energy Crush, and Pulse Launcher. So they have to do Pulse Launcher. Yep. Alright, let's see what we can do with Electrode here. Uh, 
All I can do right now. All right, let's hit him for 260. We're just gonna throw everything at him. Uh, I should hold on to a couple of things, honestly. Yeah, we'll do that. No, hold on. Everything, all the other tools gone? Yes, they are. All right, so we'll just attack like that. 210. If they hit me here, that'll get them up to 250, and then it'll be an easy KO. Um, in reality, all they have to do now is energy crush. That'll do 100 since I have two energy on in play. Oh, Cheryl. That hurts. And I don't have enough tools in my discard yet. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah. Yeah, that's only 280. Yeah, I'm one short. Oof. Oh, wait, no. I... Alright, let's take it. Let's see what we can do. No, don't want that. All right, yes, maybe I do. <laughs> uh, we'll play this guy. Anything else I can do right now? No. No, it says I can do up to 360. I apparently can't count. So what do I need to do left? Uh, two nine. I need to do 300. All right, so let's go. So four, eight. 12, 16, 200, 240, 260, 280. I'm just doing a full sun because my brain's breaking right now. I didn't have to. Or, yeah, I did. And what would he get? Any one of my supporters would be really great right about now. Because uh, this Rotom now is useless sitting here. <laughs> Actually, at this moment, both of my attackers are pretty useless at the moment. So let's see what we can do about that. <sighs> I don't know why I put Hard Charm on Electrode. I think I just... Did the throw it out there. Would have been better on Honchkrow, Rotom, anybody else. What are you doing, Raihan? What are you going to get him? As I said, this is only my second game with this deck, but I see it has potential. I think the, the um, supporter count could use some tweaking. Like, how am I only 18 cards left in deck and I've only used two supporters? This is a little crazy. And actually, an instant like this or research or something would be really beautiful. Iono, we can take it. But I don't have many tools left, do I? Three, four, five. Or th four. I can't count, apparently. <laughs> So we will Iono them down to one. I'll get four in hand. And hopefully I can get something. All right, I got something. All right, 
you have 300 HP left. You can do 260. And that's getting rid of everything. Uh, all right, let's do it. Let's hope that one card is not a Cheryl. But then again, it doesn't matter because they can pull a Cheryl. And if that's the case, this deck is out of steam. Oh. So you're saying there's a chance. Oh, no, there's not. I didn't realize they only had one, one prize card left. Okay. So that was the show, and we were doing pretty good. Uh, but it was starting to run out of steam, so as you can see where this deck's going. But all in all, it is not a bad deck. Um, go ahead and give it a try for yourself. I'm going to have it in the description down below. And y'all have a great day.